from majestic breeds shaped by battlefield heritage to horses adorned with striking leopard-like spots, these rare breeds have left an indelible mark on history and now face the looming threat of extinction. Join us as we explore the magic and allure of the rarest horses in the world that really exist. 20. Austin, the Gypsy Vanner Horse Austin, the Gypsy Vanner Horse, a living fusion of unicorn and pegasus, embodies sheer beauty within his breed. Standing at around 60 inches or 152 centimeters, which is tall for the breed, this remarkable stallion captivates onlookers with a striking snowflake spot, a gray coat, and an enchanting mane and tail, accentuating his muscular frame and commanding presence. He's called a piebald Gypsy Vanner Stallion, displaying a Tobiano pattern, which is a spotted color pattern. What truly sets Austin apart beyond his physical beauty is his humble and kind demeanor. Austin's also a champ in the Gypsy horse world, snagging wins left and right. Whether it's dressage riding, freestyle riding, or English pleasure riding, he's faced off against the best and come out on top. Bred over 50 years to be the quintessential companion for gypsy caravans and households, the Gypsy Vanner, known by various names like Gypsy Cobb, Irish Cobb, and Tinker Horse, boasts a fascinating genetic makeup. This people-sized draft horse traces its heritage back to the Shire, Clydesdale, and native British ponies like the Dale. Standing at 56 inches to 60 inches at the withers, or 142 to 152 centimeters, Gypsy Vanners display various colors, from Splash and Tobiano to Solid. However, their ornamental features, a long, freely flowing tail and mane, and an abundance of feathers hanging down from their hocks and knees, truly captivate attention. Originally bred for drawing wagons, these versatile horses have successfully transitioned into various modern disciplines such as western pleasure and jumping. 19. Atlantis, the Nabstrupper Atlantis, a stunning member of the Nabstrupper breed, specifically the Black Leopard Nabstrupper, is a remarkable horse known as Ambrosius of Asgard in Germany and Atlantis in the United States. Atlantis represents a breed that traces its roots back to spotted horses raised in Denmark as early as 1671. Officially recognized in 1812, the Nabstrupper breed gained significant recognition when Atlantis became the first Nabstrupper stallion imported into the US in 2003. With striking coloring, a confident demeanor, and a graceful gait, Nabstruppers serve as carriage horses and excel in show jumping, venting, and dressage. Standing typically between 60 inches and 64 inches tall, or 152 and 162 centimeters, these horses showcase their athletic prowess in dressage and show jumping. Nabstruppers impress with their varied coat hues. Only a few hundred remain in the wild, with surviving instances not always coming from pure bloodlines. Still, their charming nature captivates equestrian enthusiasts, especially novice riders. 18. Kambabe, a Polino Akaltek. The Akalteki horse, often hailed as the most beautiful breed globally, stands out as Turkmenistan's crown jewel. Admired by military figures and rulers from China to Kazakhstan, this horse stands out with its beautiful coat and graceful build. History even notes that an ancestor of this breed fought alongside Alexander the Great. Meet Kambabai Akalteki, a Polino stallion exuding timeless beauty. This high-blooded horse personifies nobility with an attractive head, muscular limbs, and a proportionately long body and neck. His hallmark golden sheen, characteristic of the Akal Tech breed, is truly captivating. Standing at 63 inches or 160 centimeters tall, Kambabe combines size with boldness, bravery, and secure footing, showcasing superb technique over fences. Originating from Turkmenistan, where nomadic tribesmen once relied on them for transportation, Akaltekes now excel in pleasure riding, long-distance racing, dressage, and show jumping. Known for their courage, hardiness, endurance, speed, agility, intelligence, and athleticism, these horses are more than just stunning. They embody a rich cultural history. The Teki clan in Turkmenistan's Karakum Desert established the Akal Oasis, the birthplace of the Akal Tek, millennia ago, earning them the moniker Celestial Horses. 17. The American Cream Horse The American Cream Horse, 
a distinctive draft breed, has its roots in America, specifically tracing back to a cream-colored mare named Old Granny, auctioned in Story County, Iowa in 1911. Originating in Iowa during the 20th century, this breed stands out with its eye-catching cream or gold champagne coat. Dr. Eric Christian fell in love with a foal raised by Old Granny and persuaded the Nelson brothers of Jewel, Iowa to keep it. This choice resulted in cream-colored foals with white manes and tails, pink complexion, and amber eyes. In the 1930s, cream draft horses were a common sight in Melbourne. As farmland became mechanized, the demand for draft horses decreased, posing challenges for the growing American cream breed. Despite these challenges, a dedicated few held onto their beloved creams, playing a crucial role in saving the breed. American creams vary in size, with an average wither height ranging from 60 to 67 inches or 152 to 170 centimeters. Mares weigh between 1,600 and 2,000 pounds on average, or 725 and 900 kilograms, while stallions are slightly heavier on average. Thanks to the commitment of a few devoted guardians, the American cream horse has overcome hardships, emerging as a captivating representation of the country's equestrian history. 16. The Soraya Horse The Soraya, hailing from the picturesque Iberian Peninsula in Portugal, is a unique and historic horse breed, one of the last remnants of the original wild horses. Thought to be extinct until 1920, a Portuguese scientist rediscovered this incredible breed while on a hunting expedition in the Portuguese lowlands. Determined to preserve this precious legacy, he established a rogue herd on his property, consisting of seven mares and four stallions. With ancient markings that hint at its age, the Soraya is a captivating spectacle. This breed represents its historical ancestry, sporting a dark snout profile, black-tipped ears, horizontal leg striping, and a striking black dorsal stripe. Surprisingly, the Soraya's influence reaches far beyond the Iberian Peninsula, being recognized as a key progenitor of renowned horses like the Andalusian and Lusitano, instrumental in shaping various European and American breeds. Acknowledging its historical significance, the Portuguese national stud has classified the Soraya as a breed, actively contributing to its population expansion. In Portugal and Germany today, concerted efforts are made to ensure its survival and continued presence in the equestrian industry. 15. Endo the Blind Endo, a 22-year-old Appaloosa gelding from Corvallis, Oregon, USA, is more than just a visually striking horse with charming brown speckles and a friendly disposition. Affectionately known as Endo the Blind, this remarkable horse, alongside his owner Morgan Wagner, accomplished three extraordinary records on October 29, 2022. Despite his blindness, Endo boasts the highest recorded free leap of 106 centimeters or 41 inches, achieved an impressive 39 flying changes in a minute, and completed the fastest blind horse weave through five poles in 6.93 seconds. As a gift, Morgan got to pick Endo when she was 13, among the herd of horses her grandmother owned. She picked Endo as a foal because he was special and had the most charisma. Unfortunately, Endo lost his sight at the age of 13 due to moon blindness, a condition causing inflammation in his eyes. Despite exhaustive efforts to treat him initially, medical professionals had to remove his eyes to save his life. Endo is a living testament to ability even in disability. Despite his blindness, he independently navigates his surroundings, engaging in activities like walking, grazing on grass, and playing with his pony companions. Today, Endo is renowned for breaking records. Do you find this extraordinary horse as inspiring as others do? 14. Silver Dapple Pinto Horse Chocolate Silver Dapple Pinto horses truly make a lasting impression with their stunning appearance. Horse enthusiasts globally admire these horses for their unique color and pattern combinations. Their deep, rich chocolate brown base, complemented by a lighter silver mane and tail, defines the captivating chocolate silver dapple coat. This cool mix makes them stand out. Threads of silver 
add a glistening touch to their mane and tail, enhancing their overall look. Whether on the trails or in the show ring, these horses stand out, drawing attention. Beyond their enchanting appearance, Chocolate Silver Dapple Pinto horses are skilled performers in various disciplines, such as western riding, pleasure riding, show jumping, and dressage. Their adaptability, combined with a pleasant and serene disposition often inherited from their parent breeds, makes them suitable for riders of varying expertise levels. This unique and captivating breed combines the charm of Pinto markings with the allure of the chocolate silver dapple color. Hugely sought after by horse enthusiasts worldwide, these horses continue to captivate, whether showcased in the ring or enjoyed on a leisurely trail ride. So what's your favorite aspect of these mesmerizing chocolate silver dapple Pinto horses? 13. Eriske Ponies Eriske Ponies, one of the few surviving specimens of the original native ponies that formerly roamed the Scottish Western Isles, are an exceptional breed. These robust and adaptable ponies have a long history as crofters' ponies, having been used for various jobs like harrowing and cart pulling since the middle of the 1800s when they were common throughout the islands. Standing 48 to 54 inches, or 122 to 137 centimeters tall, Eriskai ponies have a thick coat that keeps them waterproof and allows them to survive the severe winter weather outside. Though some are observed in black or bay, grey is their predominant colour. They have a very powerful back because of their long ribs and short loins, and even though they are little, they can easily lift light adults. Their feet are tidy and their legs are beautiful, but one distinctive characteristic is the little tuft of hair at the fetlock. Though small, Eriske ponies are incredibly strong and resilient, and they do exceptionally well in various horse disciplines, including dressage, western riding, driving, cross-country, show jumping, and trekking. They also make fantastic driving ponies and are even used in equine-assisted therapy. Sadly, there is currently a threat to the Eriske breed's number, which makes them an uncommon and valuable sight. 12. The Royal Mawari The Mawari, also known as the Milani, emerges as a captivating and exceedingly rare breed when delving into the extensive history of Indian horses. These magnificent animals, showcasing their prowess as combat horses on renowned battlefields for centuries, trace their lineage back to the 12th century. Initially bred as loyal companions for kings and troops, Mawaris are exclusively found in India, designated as national treasures with strict prohibitions on exportation. Referred to as Suryaput, signifying son of Surya or the sun deity, these horses are believed to have descended from the heavens in India. Legend has it that the Mawari breed originated when Sanja Surya's wife transformed into a horse for solace with her husband following suit out of love. Distinguished by their uniquely touching ears, Mawaris present an awe-inspiring sight with exquisite looks and graceful movements. Genetically linked to another local breed, Mawaris played a crucial role in conflicts, carrying valiant fighters into battle. Beyond the battlefield, they served as the community's primary mode of transportation, navigating challenging terrains during the exodus of 1193. 11. Suffolk Punch Hailing from Suffolk, England, the Suffolk Punch horse has a captivating history dating back to the 15th century. It is one of the oldest and purest of English working horses. Its lineage can be traced to the birth of Crisp's horse in 1768, setting the foundation for this exceptional breed. Local farmers, envisioning a horse tailored for the rigors of farming, played a crucial role in its development. Despite its compact size and sturdy build, the Suffolk Punch boasts an impressive work ethic and unwavering commitment to labor. This equine powerhouse handles demanding tasks with ease. However, the breed faced challenges during World War II and the advent of modern agricultural technology leading to a significant decline in numbers. Fewer than 300 breeding mares are left in this remarkable bloodline today. The Suffolk Punch's compact size, robust physique, and unfeathered legs contribute to its charm. This feature provides a distinct advantage when working in heavy soil compared to other horse breeds. 
Adorned in rich chestnut hues, Suffolk punch horses exhibit a spectrum of liver and lemon tones. Despite adversity, this breed has preserved its reputation as a symbol of tenacity and diligence. 10. Whiskey, the Spotted Saddle Horse Whiskey, a 15-year-old spotted saddle horse from the United States, is a captivating example of this unique breed. Born from the crossbreeding of Spanish-American type-gated pinto ponies and gated horse breeds like Tennessee walking horses, Whiskey embodies the distinctive qualities of the spotted saddle horse. With a fluid gait and a vibrant coat, standing proudly at 58 inches or 147 centimeters tall, Whiskey has undergone extensive training. His owner attests to his exceptional courage, recounting instances where Whiskey fearlessly rode through a ring of fire, showcasing the extent of his bravery. Beyond his daring feats, Whiskey is recognized for his pleasant demeanor and terrific temperament, characteristic of the spotted saddle horses known for their reliability, calmness, and friendliness towards people. These horses, distinguished by their striking coloration and graceful gaits, are versatile in their applications. Excelling in leisure and trail riding, they cater to both casual riders and participants in the show ring. Individuals favor gated horses like Whiskey with back or knee issues due to their comfortable riding style. The Spotted Saddle Horse breed further shines in the show circuit, with events like the Spotted Saddle Horse World Grand Championship in Tennessee, featuring diverse classes such as halter, country pleasure, and trail pleasure. 9. The Fjord Horse the Fjord Horse, also known as the Norwegian Fjord Horse, hails from the rugged mountains of western Norway, showcasing a robust and enduring breed with roots dating back over a millennium. Boasting a lineage tied to the European wild horse Tarpon and sharing characteristics with agile light draft horses, the Fjord Horse has a rich history. Its domestication in Norway began more than 4,000 years ago, evolving through purposeful breeding for over 2,000 years. Vikings in 1200 BC relied on these sturdy horses for both combat and transportation, leaving an indelible mark on breeds like the Icelandic horse and the Highland pony in Scotland and Iceland. Despite their compact size, fjords are exceptionally strong, ranging between 900 and 1,000 pounds, or 400 to 500 kilograms, and standing between 53 and 59 inches, or 135 and 150 centimeters tall. Their medium-sized heads feature broad, flat foreheads and large, expressive eyes, giving them a distinctive appearance. Beyond their charming exterior, the Fjord Horse holds a cherished place among riders worldwide, symbolizing power and adaptability in the equestrian realm, thanks to its Norwegian origins and enduring influence on other breeds. 8. JJ's Summer Breeze JJ's Summer Breeze is an American paint horse. It proudly holds the title for the horse with the longest tail, as officially recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records an impressive 12 and a half feet or 381 centimeters. This extraordinary achievement has set a new standard in the equine world, prompting one to wonder about the unique experience of galloping with such a remarkable tail trailing behind. As JJ's summer breeze gracefully sways her magnificent tail, it's important to note that this eye-catching feature isn't left to its own devices outside the arena. Her dedicated owner, Crystal Socha goes the extra mile to ensure its immaculate upkeep. The tail is carefully braided and shielded with a delicate tube sock to preserve its beauty. JJ's Summer Breeze is more fascinating because of her tail's size evolution. Maintaining such an elaborate tail demands dedicated care. Crystal diligently combs it every two months to ensure the finest quality of its silken strands. Surprisingly, this meticulous task takes three hours to complete. That's quite a long time to be braiding a horse's hair. 7. Choctaw Indian Pony 
The Choctaw Pony, renowned for its resilience and loyalty, boasts a remarkable history, from enduring the Trail of Tears to gracing the screen in the beloved film Hidalgo. Despite its scarcity, there is optimism for the future of this rare Spanish colonial breed based on its historical roots. Though it aligns with the description of a Spanish colonial horse, the Choctaw horse is not commonly labeled as such. Among the roughly 3,000 colonial Spanish horses, only around 250 are pure Choctaw horses due to their diverse genetics. Interestingly, the Choctaw horses we see today trace their lineage back to those brought to the New World by Spanish conquistadors in the 1500s. Native Americans in the Deep South encountered horses much later, around the 1600s, referring to these creatures as spirit dogs. When Hernando de Soto and his Spanish army sought wealth, the Choctaw, displaying courage and morality, defended their land and rejected slavery. The Spaniards bestowed some of these spirit dogs upon the Choctaws, who seamlessly integrated them into their way of life. Notably, Choctaw women played a crucial role in caring for these creatures. The cultural significance of these horses in Choctaw culture is vividly portrayed in the tale of Frank Hopkins and his Indian Pinto pony, inspiring the movie Hidalgo. The potential extinction of the Choctaw pony would be a profound loss, given its remarkable history and cultural importance. 6. Falabella Hailing from Argentina, these charming creatures are incredibly adorable and hold the title of the smallest horse breed on our list and among all horse breeds with a height at the withers of 25 to 34 inches or 63 to 86 centimeters. And for good reason, as Falabella horses were selectively bred for small size. The breeding program was initiated by the Falabella family, which aimed to create a miniature horse with the characteristics of larger horse breeds. They are often likened to miniature Arab horses in appearance, conformation, and temperament. Much like Arabian horses, they possess a spirited side. While these horses are commonly kept as pets, they can also be trained for driving and ridden by children. Personally, I'm sold on the idea of having one. They are undeniably cute. 5. Galicino the captivating history of Galicino horses in America intertwines with the adventures of explorers like Christopher Columbus and Herman Cortez. Picture the scene, riding up with a group of people and horses to announce the discovery of a new land. Columbus's second voyage to the New World in 1500 included horses, establishing the foundation for an incredible adventure. Herman Cortez continued this tradition by starting a breeding herd in Cuba using horses from the northern Spanish region of Galicia. The Galicheño, treasured by natives in Mexico's coastal regions for its intelligence, beauty, graceful gaits and endurance, has a gentle and easy-to-handle nature, making it an ideal family horse. Since the era of the conquistadors, the Galicheño has showcased exceptional natural intellect, serving both beginners and experts. Despite their small size, Galicheños possess hardiness, courage, and stamina that rival many larger horses. Their fluid gaits reduce rider fatigue, and their agility and speed make them excellent cutting horses, well-suited for timed competitions or reigning classes. Distinguishing themselves from pony breeds, Galicheños exude substance, style, attractiveness, and a naturally occurring running gait. Remarkably, genetic data from Texas A&M's genetics department reveals a close link between Iberian Garanos and Galicenos, emphasizing their significance. Galicenos stand out for their outstanding purity and minimal interbreeding with other breeds as the most ancient Spanish colonial horses in the Americas. Unfortunately, their continued existence is endangered, with less than 200 Galicenos remaining. 4. The Belgian Brabant The captivating history of the iconic Belgian draft horse, a majestic presence in American landscapes, traces its roots to the Brabant, affectionately known as the Belgian Heavy Draft, often colloquially referred to as just Belgium. This magnificent breed, originally named the Flanders Horse in the Middle Ages, originates in the Flanders region of Central Europe. The Brabant's influence extends far and wide, impacting other notable draft horse breeds like the Suffolk Punch, Clydesdale, and Shire. 
What sets the Brabant apart is its historical resilience. While market demands leaned towards lighter cavalry horses, Belgian breeders, recognizing the ideal conditions of the Flanders region, focused on enhancing the Brabant's traits. Belgian breeders crafted a robust and powerful heavy draft horse through meticulous breeding and a commitment to maintaining purity. Standing at an impressive height of 66 to 68 inches, or 167 to 173 centimeters, the Brabant slightly outmuscles the Belgian draft, which is more prevalent in the United States, yet shares a similar size and shape. These gentle giants are cherished for their friendly and easygoing nature, winning the hearts of laborers and equestrian enthusiasts. Even today, Belgian horses play pivotal roles in various tasks that demand the strength and reliability of a draft horse. 3. The Bashkir Curly Horse Speaking of horses with a great sense of fashion, let's introduce the Bashkir Curly, a horse that effortlessly stands out with its mesmerizing curly coat. Also known as American Bashkir Curlies or North American Curly Horses, these equines are celebrated for their tenacity and gentle demeanor. While the exact roots of this unique breed remain a mystery, their distinctive curly coats hint at a possible connection to the Tajikistan region. In a fascinating tale dating back to 1898, young Peter DeMille and his father encountered three horses with tight curling ringlets while riding in the secluded high country of central Nevada near Austin, Texas. This encounter significantly shaped the American ancestry of Bashkir Curlies. A standout feature of these horses is their ability to completely shed their mane in warm months, regrowing it in the cold, a unique trait shared with the rest of their hair. The absence of allergens in their coat adds to their appeal, making them an excellent choice for equestrian enthusiasts with hay fever. Sporting medium-sized, straight legs, large eyes for expanded vision, and sturdy black hooves, Bashkir curlies are not just pretty faces. Their versatility shines through as they excel in various equestrian sports, including pole bending, barrel racing, and western riding. 2. Newfoundland Pony the Newfoundland Pony, hailing from its namesake province, boasts a fascinating history rooted in the island's rich heritage. This resilient breed traces its origins back over four centuries to the interbreeding of various pony types. Shaped by Newfoundland's rugged climate and natural surroundings, this pony emerges as a highly adaptable and versatile companion. Sporting two distinct body types, fine-boned and stocky, ranging from 44 to 58 inches, or 112 to 147 centimeters, the Newfoundland Pony exhibits characteristics such as a muscular build, durable hooves, and feathered fetlocks, reflecting its ability to thrive in harsh conditions. Known for its bravery, perceptiveness, and obedience, Pony excels in navigating severe winter landscapes. Its historical role as a valuable asset to the community underscores its versatility and trustworthiness. Displaying strength, intellect and obedience, the Newfoundland Pony seamlessly carried out various tasks, from pulling carts and tilling the ground, to aiding in fishing and transporting wood. Once flourishing with tens of thousands proudly calling Newfoundland home, the Newfoundland ponies faced a decline in utility with the advent of ATVs, tractors, and snowmobiles in the 1960s. Today, 250 of the surviving 500 ponies are mature enough to breed. 1. The Shire Horse with majestic Clydesdale-like feathered feet, the Shire Horse stands impressively tall, reaching between 64 and 68 inches, or 162 and 173 centimeters. As a draft horse, the Shire is among the largest and one of the tallest horses on the planet. The breed draws its name from the English countryside, serving as the backdrop for the Lord of the Rings Shire and the historical origin of these magnificent horses. Weighing over a ton, Shire horses are among the world's largest, making them ideal for warhorse duties. Surprisingly, despite their size, they are renowned for their extraordinary calmness. Trained to remain composed even amid a chaotic battlefield, Shire horses rarely rear or buck. This composure was vital as their primary role was in battle, demanding the ability to stay calm under extreme stress. The Shire Horse traces its origins back to the reign of Henry II, arising from the necessity for robust horses capable of carrying heavily armored warriors. 
Knights, weighing over 400 pounds or 180 kilograms with armor, posed a challenge for common horses to support. Recognizing this need for specialized war horses, the monarchs sought out horses with unique traits, giving rise to the regal Shire horse. Today, their majestic presence and gentle nature continue to captivate, carrying on the legacy of this versatile breed. Which of these extraordinary horses has left a lasting impression on you? Let us know your favorite and why in the comments below. Stay tuned for more captivating content, and until next time.